The Punic Wars. Guiding question. How did Rome conquer the Mediterranean region? Rome continued to grow as a republic. Its power, however, was threatened by another civilization in the Mediterranean region. Carthage was a powerful trading empire based along the North African coast. Carthage traced its beginnings to the Phoenicians, who created a trading colony there about 800 BC. Carthage became the largest and wealthiest city in the western Mediterranean area because of trade. Its territory included parts of northern Africa and southern Europe. Carthage became Rome's main rival. Each wanted to control the entire Mediterranean world. In 264 BC, their rivalry intensified. It grew into a series of wars that took place over a period of nearly 120 years. The Punic Wars began. War between the Romans and the Carthaginians, or the people of Carthage, erupted in 264 BC. The original conflict is known as the First Punic War. The First Punic War began when Rome sought control of the fertile island of Sicily. The Carthaginians had already established colonies on the island, so they were determined to stop the Roman invasion. Carthage used its strong navy to protect its trading empire. Although Rome had a powerful army, it did not have a navy. It was forced to build a fleet quickly in order to fight Carthage. The Romans modeled their new warships after those of Carthage. They made one key innovation. They built a small movable bridge on the front of each ship. This bridge allowed Roman soldiers to board a Carthaginian ship and fight hand-to-hand -hand on its decks. In a way, it changed a sea war into a land war. For more than 20 years, the Romans and Carthaginians fought each other at sea. Finally, in 241 BC, a Roman fleet badly defeated Carthage's navy off the coast of Sicily. Carthage was forced to give up Sicily and pay a huge fine to the Romans. Rome then took control of the island. Hannibal Attacks The Second Punic War After losing Sicily, Carthage tried to expand its empire into Spain. They wanted to make up for the losses caused by Rome taking over Sicily. Spain had valuable resources of silver, copper, gold, lead, and iron. The Romans bitterly opposed Carthage's attempt to establish territory so near to Rome. So the Romans encouraged the Spanish to rebel against Carthage. In response, Carthage sent its greatest general, Hannibal, to attack Rome. This event in 218 BC started the Second Punic War. Hannibal planned to fight the Romans in Italy. To do this, he gathered an army of about 46,000 men and 37 elephants. He sailed from Carthage to Spain. Then his soldiers marched through southern Gaul, or present-day France. Next, they crossed the Alps into Italy. The Carthaginians crossed the Alps with their elephants, hoping to overpower the Roman army. Instead, the bitter cold and attacks by mountain tribes killed almost half of the Carthaginian soldiers and most of the elephants. The remaining army, however, was still a powerful fighting force when it reached Italy. As Hannibal and his army grew closer and closer to Italy and the Roman forces, Roman military leaders looked to the Senate for advice. Primary Source They, the Roman commanders, therefore sent frequent messages to Rome asking for instructions in view of the fact that the country was being plundered. The Senate passed a resolution, give the enemy battle. From the Histories of Polybius by Polybius. In 216 BC, Hannibal defeated the Romans at the Battle of Cannae in southern Italy. Following the battle, Hannibal's army raided the country. In response, the Romans assembled another army to stop the Carthaginians. In 206 BC, Roman forces, led by Scipio, captured Spain and then attacked the city of Carthage. Hannibal returned home to North Africa to defend his people. 
Scipio's troops defeated the Carthaginians in 202 BC at the Battle of Zama. Carthage was forced to give up its navy and pay Rome a large sum of money. It also had to give its Spanish territory to Rome. As a result, Rome became the supreme power in the Western Mediterranean. The Third Punic War Rome still considered Carthage a military threat. In 146 BC, Rome finally destroyed it in the Third Punic War. At the same time, Rome also waged war against other states in the Eastern Mediterranean region. In the 140s BC, all of Greece fell under Roman rule. About 20 years later, Rome acquired its first province in Asia. Progress Check how did Hannibal lose the Second Punic War? Connections to today. Hannibal's elephants. Historians have wondered how Hannibal obtained elephants for his march. Were they Indian or African elephants? Indian elephants are easier to train. In fact, most circus elephants today are Indian elephants. However, it would have been very difficult for Hannibal to obtain elephants from India. Even African elephants are not native to North Africa, where Hannibal started his march. Historians continue to question which type of elephant Hannibal used, or how he obtained them.